A federal judge today denied a request by the Standing Rock Sioux for a temporary injunction against the Dakota Access Pipeline. But federal agencies almost immediately said they wouldn't allow work on Army Corps of Engineers land bordering Lake Oahe until they decide whether they need to re-examine earlier decisions on the site. The president of the North Dakota Petroleum Council says he's disappointed with the federal government's decision to intervene in the construction of the pipeline. Standing Rock's tribal chairman told protesters gathered at the North Dakota Capitol grounds that a public policy win regarding the Dakota Access Pipeline is a lot stronger than a judicial win. Meanwhile, Energy Transfer Partners spokeswoman Vicki Granado said in an email to the Associated Press that the company did not have a statement on Friday's developments. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.